first, uh, I want to thank the iron workers. Uh, it has been fun to watch this go up. Uh, it's not, uh, it's dangerous work. Let's just put it that way. And what we see before us is just a glimpse into Evansville's future. So let's start by thanking the iron workers who've been so helpful to get this. Just a brief uh, little snippet on what a topping out ceremony is. It's the celebration of, that's really cherished by iron workers. It's a ritual based on centuries old traditions, customs, and legends. Uh, it needs no ex explanation to iron workers, but for the benefit of the rest of us, uh, it simply means the placement of the topmost member of the steel structure, whether it's uh, whether it be a bridge or a skyscraper. In this case, a uh, almost skyscraper. Uh, topping out ceremonies are like all other rich traditions. They do not seem to have a lot of consistent rules or rituals, uh, but it does run deep. And iron workers, who of course deny that they are superstitious, and we're doing this on St. Patrick's Day, uh, says it brings good luck. Uh, so, what we're about to see is good luck for this project. Uh, there are so many people to thank. Uh, we need to start by thanking uh, former governor and current vice president Mike Pence, who included this in a budget. We need to thank members of the Indiana legislature, the leadership, and our local delegation who have done so much to help get that legislation passed so we can get the funding here. Uh, we need to thank members of the Common Council, the city of Evansville, who helped us cobble together the uh, subsidy package so that the city of Evansville could partner with this. Uh, we need to thank our partner uh, institutions, uh, Indiana University, Kirk White is here, the University of Evansville, the University of Southern Indiana, uh, Indiana University, of course, um, so many people coming together to make this work. Like so many things going on in the city now, this is a result of great collaboration. And uh, forgive me for using a really bad pun, but I am beaming today. <laughs> uh, this building will educate a new pipeline of healthcare professionals that will help our city, our region, and our state grow and become even more vibrant. So to everyone who had anything to do with getting us to this point, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, this topping out ceremony is uh, it's just a great symbol of great things to come for the city. So without further ado, Barb, Let's direct the crew. Away. So we're going to move the beam over in place. And as you can see over here on the med school, on the top fourth floor, the opening, this will be our last main structural beam that will place up.
Awesome job. Yay. You get all the credit.